the truth the girls. Hi everyone, it's Sonia here. Yeah. There is a whale in our port, and we're going to go see it. I've got the binoculars, the sandwiches. I got Gunny here. The way you're standing back there, like, I know, it's so awkward. Are you ready to go? Gunner's ready. He's got his shoes and socks on. Talking to his little friend uh, on, uh, on PlayStation. Talking to his American friend on PlayStation. Okay, are you ready to go now? Friend. You gonna go see this whale with me? You excited? Okay, well, yeah. well let's go then. On a side note, transitions are very difficult. I'm not saying that to complain. I'm just saying it's not like you can just be like, come on, let's go, and then it goes. It's like there's always like a bit of a delay. And look, the, look at me. So I got all my stuff here. I'm all loaded up. I'm fully ready to go, eager to get out of here. I'm gonna have to be patient. You know, let's go now, okay? I know, but... You need to just put the headphones away. No, if you want to see the whale, you have to put the headphones I away. See the whale. Yes. Put the headphones away, and let's get out. Gunner, if Wait. you don't get up now, this video is going to be about how we didn't go whale watching because I couldn't get you off the couch. So let's not make that happen. Let's go. Let's just get up now. You can hear my my house the sounds of my house. Come on, let's go out the door. The TV. We're gonna go give the dog the pill. You're gonna. Oh yeah, put it on the TV. Okay. That's it. You look great, man. Look at him. Wait, stay there. Look, doesn't he look great? Look at his nice little outfit there. And he's got a dolphin shirt because we're going to see a whale. What? Yeah, it's like appropriate. A aquatic life shirt for the aquatic life field trip. All right, take the jacket in case it's cold. We don't know what we're going to end up doing. You might need it. You might get ocean spray. What is it's June. Why is it so cold? I'm so excited. You guys know I have a dog? <laughs> this is the dog. See, he lives down here with Aaron in the other apartment. This is his man cave. And it's got papers because the dog has a pee pee problem. <laughs> Which reminds me, speaking of that, speaking of smells, look what we have in here. We got one of those pouches to remove the smell that the dog leaves behind. So if you're wondering what this says, click the link below for more info. 15% off and no shipping and handling for a three pack of pouches, even if you live in Canada. Mm, okay. Finally, we're on the road. There's just one more thing I have to do. Exchange my nasty leopard cougar glasses for my Tootsie glasses. <laughs> These are my driving glasses. So in case you're wondering why, it's because I use them for driving. These are actually um, a pair that I had from when I was 12. I actually chose and wore these uh, back in 1983. And now they're back in style, although I find they look a bit weird. They're not in style. Yeah, they are. With young people, with people like me, it just makes me look like <laughs> Tootsie, actually. Why, 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 why is it in style? I don't know. Things come back. That's how it is. Okay, let's go see that whale. Look, this is where the protests were the other day. I don't know. There's no damage here. I think it was very limited just to other street. This is a street that I was on. Nothing here. I'm lost already. It's ridiculous. It's my city. I go here all the time, but I, I can never keep track of what's why. What. It's, it's really weird. I heard it's an autism thing. Lots of Aspies get lost all the time. Let me know if you get lost too. <laughs> okay, does that say yeah. Beaver Hall? Beaver Hall? Yeah. Okay, this is the one I want. As long as I don't run over anybody, everything should be okay. Most Canadians who have such interesting street names. Yeah, it's so Canadian, eh? Beaver, beaver Hall. Hall. Well, it's Canada. Let me see your beaver. <laughs> I would like a beaver, though. Really? You think that we have problems with the rabbits? Wait till you get a beaver. Your chair will be like... It just like... No more of this like delicate gnawing. The, the legs of the chairs will be whoosh, in half. Also, it's, first day. it's a little tail. It's going to create like a little... Uh, I'll build a dam. And a nook shook, it'll build a dam in the bathroom. <laughs> it'll dam up the bathtub. It'll bring all the rabbit hay and put it in the bathroom. <laughs> I wonder if they can bite with those huge teeth. I kind oh, of, they can. I'm pretty sure, yeah. But those and things I are huge. Can bite. Yeah, but like, I mean, bite effectively. Like, inflict yes. some damage. One time I saw a beaver skeleton with its teeth. Yeah? 
and it looked like They're a like this long. saber tooth tiger. All the way up into its yeah. All the way up into its into its jaw, like all the way up. And yeah. there's like half of it, it's like up there and the other half. So it's actually like as long Twice as, as long. Yeah, it's like a saber tooth beaver. People are like, oh beavers are so cute. And they're like, ah. Yeah. And they, yeah. Always, have, they always have yellow teeth because of like They some smoke a lot. Oh. Yeah, that too. So that they have strong teeth. I drink a lot of tea. I think that's it. Check it out. Old Montreal. This is so nice down here. It's so cool. I love this part of the city. Isn't that the old factory down there too. Old sugar factory. Look at this. These are all like buildings from the 1700s and stuff. The original old Montreal. Check it out. We got lucky. We got a parking spot. How cool is that? Really close to the port. What? Ooh, in the comments, tell us what that S is for. Yeah, he wants to know what is that. This is a very old building. This is probably 1700s. That's pretty cool. Gunner really loves old buildings. I love old buildings too, especially when they have writing on them. I know, it's really great. I love that fire escape. That's awesome. Writing's still on it. It, yeah, there's a few with writing. Ah, this one has lots of writing on it. Come on, Gunnar, let's go find the whale before it decides yeah, to leave. Okay. Also, those windows look cool. The green ones. Yeah. I love buildings. And I'm glad that my kid likes to go out and check out buildings. And I feel pretty lucky. Where will the whale be? The whale? It's down there somewhere. We have to go look for it. Alright, here's the water. Um, I don't see any whale right now. Oh, come on. Where's the whale? Okay, here's where the boats are. Oh, I had to put my Tootsie glasses back on so I can see. Because these are for distance, you know? The other ones are for, like, in the house. Because I can't stand by focals. So if I wear these in the house all the time, it's too much of a strain. So that's why, like, I have two. I usually just wear these for driving and for whale watching. Those are the little boats. Remember we went on a cruise with one of these, Gunner? You remember when we went on that cruise? Mm -hmm. And you ran away from me? We went on a boat like that. He ran all over. He ran away from me. He got away. You were like five or six. Yeah, he eloped, man. It was scary for me. Seen any whales? Not today. No? Saw some recently though, right? Oh, I don't know. We're looking for the whale. They saw a humpback whale, like, whatever it was, a couple of days ago. That's what I heard. Oh, we're going the wrong way. They move. They yeah. Move. Well, we'll go down that way then. Check it out. This is the science center where there's like activities and museums and restaurants. It's all closed still. I guess we are kind of still locked down. Goes to show how much I know. Oh, this is where, oh my gosh, look, this is where the boats are usually. Gunner, you notice anything? Yeah, there's no boats. That's strange. You think the boats are still here, though? I think that's maybe because they take them away for the winter. Yeah. But usually by June they would be back in here. So that's because of the lockdown. They didn't bring their boats back. No boats this year. Hmm. Oh, look at the beautiful little park we have here, though. This is very old, too. Isn't this gorgeous? These trees hanging branches, blossoms here and there. I love this little park. Just looking at the park. It's a really nice spot down here. I love to be near the water too. Oh, they got these signs up here, keep your distance, and like arrows on the ground showing you where to go. The empty boardwalk. All these things usually have little stores and stuff. And there's the zip line. Oh, that's a cute dog. Oh, I just. I don't know if she loves you. Maybe not because, you know, COVID. <laughs> Gunner found something. What did you find? Duck with chicks and She's sitting down there all by herself. No, she has her chicks. Yeah, underneath her she has all her babies. Oh look, she's protecting them. 
How many? Is there just one there? Two, I think. Oh, two. Ducklings. Yeah, ducklings. So cute. This over here, this is like my nightmare. It's called a SOS Labyrinth. Labyrinth, obviously. And um, it's a super old, creepy building. And inside, it's like this maze that you can't get out of. I don't know why anyone would want to go in here. I certainly wouldn't, but apparently a lot of people do. Okay, let's go down here. I'm pretty sure that's where you see. Yeah, take this, take your binoculars. Keep an eye out for the whale. It's out there somewhere. It is out there. This is pretty cool. You can even see the little boats here. Oh, those are the jet boats that they use. I bet that's fun, yeah. We should do it sometime. Oh, whoa, yes. Definitely, this is where people are watching for the whale. Look at this huge crowd. It goes all the way down. Uh-huh, yeah. Gunner, I think we found the whale watching spot. Get your binoculars out. Check out these cool binoculars he has. <laughs> That's so cute. This is it. There's a whale out there somewhere. There, you see the difference in the water? It could be there. It could be. Oh, there it is! It's right there! It's right over there! Oh my god! Oh, we just saw it! It's here! Yeah, so it is there. I can't believe it! Oh, there it is again. Oh! Oh, there it is! I saw that. It just spouted yeah, keep your binoculars up so you can see it. That is so cool. It's sort of frolicking around out there. It keeps cu coming up and going back down. It's going to come again. Get ready. Do you see it? Oh, there it is. I just saw it. Oh, it's it spouting. Right yeah. Wow. Gunner, are you excited? <laughs> yeah. It is exciting. It's so cool. Tons of people showed up. Everybody wants to see the whale. And even across the, uh, the river over there on that little island, it's full of people. All the way down too. Wow. The whale is very popular. She's out there, right around there. Is it a girl or a guy? I don't really know. I'm just assuming she's a girl. Could be a guy whale. Oh, they're gonna scare her off. Oh. Oh, there it is! There she blows! Oh yeah. Yeah man, you can totally see that whale. Did you see the whale a lot? Oh yeah, it just pops up. It does, like every few minutes, couple minutes. And it's, it's pretty small, I mean, for a whale. No, it's, it's pretty big because you're only seeing its back and if it was here, its back would be from there to there. And then it's tail. You think? Look, that's a big whale. I guess I had high expectations for a humpback whale. What? No, it's big. All right, I'm going to patiently wait now until that whale pops up. One last time. Ah, I see something spouting. There it is. That's it. Anyway, that was pretty cute. So what do you think? Was this cool? Yes. <laughs> it's gonna be here for a while if you want to come back. Yeah, it's not like one of those things where you're like on the Antarctic and you know, you're whale watching and then you're on a boat and you're like it flying at the whales and you see them go and splash and like, oh, yeah. do a flip over you or something. Whale boat. <laughs> yeah, whale boating. <laughs> it's not like that, it's but it's super cool to see a whale. Like that's my first time seeing a whale. I think. Gunny. 
We yeah. should head back. Yeah, sure, okay. Yes? Okay, great. Because we have whoa, a whoa, half whoa. an hour. Whoa, it just jumped up. Again? No, 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 like really? full, like, woo. Oh, I didn't see it. it was, well, no, nah, not exactly. But you got to see the whole thing. It was really big. That's cool. We can come back, you know. One last little bit, and we really have to go because parking, you know? Oh, I don't want it. I don't want it. Okay. So what, again? Yeah, I know. We just can't get enough whale. As soon as we say, okay, that's it. We're going to go. We're going to wrap it up. And then, oh, look. It was fun, but we got to say goodbye to the whale now. Let's say goodbye. Say goodbye to your friend, the whale. <laughs> <laughs> that's your reward today, you got a giant Fiji. Careful, Gunny. Mmm, <laughs> so tasteful. Oh, I just, I might have... Oh, last drop. Mmm. <laughs> <laughs> You guys, that went super well. We have a new deal, him and I, or him and me. We have a deal. The leaving is leaving smoothly is very, very important because we had problems in the past with like ending an activity. So I think this year it's gonna go better. It's like every year it gets a bit better. For those of you who have kids, you know, on the spectrum, you're, you know, your little wild cats when they're young and everything. But uh, he's almost 13. He's gonna be 13 at the end of the month. That went very, very well. So I'm hoping we'll be able to do more things because before it was stuff like the transitions out and then back in was, it was so hard that oh, I couldn't do it. <laughs> Not very often. Well, that went well. The, the whale certainly turned up and satisfied the audience. Yeah. Yeah. So that's it, you guys. Thanks so much for joining us. God bless you. Thanks for joining us and we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.